Um, I've got like a ton of ghost followers that I'm, I'm not too sure how I can re-engage them or should I just... Hey guys, if you want to know how you can grow your true fan base on Instagram and if you need to delete your ghost followers or not, keep on watching. What's up you guys, we're at the community library. What's up Dharma Nation? It is Jade Dharma Wangza. In today's episode, we're gonna go over everything new, everything that you want to know. You guys are actually gonna call me up and I'm gonna answer your deepest, darkest questions on social media and growing your business. This is the series where I ask your questions every single Saturday. Please stay to the end if you wanna know how you can be on the next Ask Jade show. Some of you guys have been commenting, raccoon? And I think it looks like a skunk, but you guys let me know what my microphone looks like to you. The number and dial again. What? Alright, next. What's up, Kenneth? What's your question? How can I help you? Um, on my, um, Instagram, um, like, I get growth, but I want to grow more. Like, uh, okay, okay, and? Like, currently I have, like, 724 followers, but I want to grow, like, more. And? Um... Boy, I have- I'm looking at your Instagram, you have one post. Do you think you could squeeze out more posts and content? Yeah, I could. At least, like, 5k by the end of the year. Alright, easy. Post every day. I like- by the way! Nice captions. Have a little content schedule. If it's whether a selfie a day, a selfie on your stories every single day, let me know what works good for you. But man, you got to put out at least 100 pieces of content for people to trust you and follow you. I think you're not doing enough. And don't complain. Just work harder, okay? Okay. So yeah, I just let, I let that out there. So if you haven't already, make sure you like this video and subscribe. That's my mom. Like this video for my mom. Subscribe for my mom. She's been... Wait, come on. Come here. Come here. Like and... Subscribe. There's a two hour limit on this place, so I gotta keep going through the calls. Keep in mind, if I ever, ever miss your call, you're always able to sign up for the next one. I'm happy to put you on the first session on the next opening, so just let me know. Hoping for a really good call. The Dharma Nation was super good two weeks ago. Last week was a little bit of a miss. Uh, maybe it was because I was traveling, but let's see. The Dharma Nation has a good question this time. Shade. Hey, what is up, girl? I'm actually on, um, Auditioning for NBC The Voice today. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. Okay, good luck. So after watching your videos, I installed TubeBuddy. Right. So for tags, I use the top five that they suggest. Have you ever checked if you're ranking on any of your searches? No. Because you're not ranking, which means that's why people can't find you. So my biggest tip is to either use a competition's tags. You can use totally just use those and copy and paste or use uh, date sensitive titles. For example, vegan food 2018 for lazy people. Like the more specific you are with date, you can rank higher. What's up, Victor? You're on the Ask Date show. Yay. Woo. Woo. Hello. I do like book summaries. Um, I've got like a ton of ghost followers that I'm, I'm not too sure how I can re-engage them or should I just, you know, unfollow, block them. So listen, man, never, if you are ever contemplating this in your life, do not use the cleaner app. Have you heard of the cleaner app that like deletes all your ghosts? Seen it, um, but I, I haven't used it. Don't use it. It ruined my... Okay, basically, I similarly to you, I was like, why not delete the ghost followers? Like, no! So basically, when you use a third-party app, Instagram smells it, Instagram smells that it, it's, like, fishy, so they start shadow banning you hardcore, so you're going to get lower engagement. I would do it manual. I would never do that with a third-party app. Just do it manually if you ever find someone that's, like, puppy lover 101 and has no relevance to you. Got it? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Have you specified the age demographic? Like when you when you run your Facebook ads, what is your targeting? Because I feel like you're experienced in this. Can you run me down? What's your targeting when you place an ad? Thirty-eight or thirty-five years old, um, and people who like um, content from like Gary Vaynerchuk, Tim Ferriss. I think. Do you ever do anything per maybe? Because think about it, man. You're making an account. Are these like summaries or more of like I don't know, like reviews? Um. It's more summaries, actually. See? Okay, see, the thing is, when you have someone who does summary, like, content, don't you think, what, tell me if you don't agree, because I'm, I'm just throwing ideas. I don't read books. I'm very busy. Do you think this is a good page for people that really don't give a crap about reading the book and wanted something more fast-paced, correct? <laughs> Therefore, I, I would target someone even younger, because old, sorry, old people, 
don't mind reading the freaking whole book. So maybe I think you should target those inpatient kids that like drop shipping. Do you know what I'm talking about? Like those people like yeah. swipe up to buy. I feel like you should target those people because your graphics look great. Young kids will like it. Old people will too. I think you're you're losing because you're targeting people that already read the book, so they don't really care. People really don't care unless it's valuable. I think this would be so valuable to someone like me, young and stupid, but like loves fast paced things. Do do you agree? Maybe that's something you can yeah. target. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I see the point, yeah. The Make sure you guys check the podcast. Uh, I hopped off a call. I don't know if it was recording, but Henry said he liked the podcast. I'll replay the footage. I'm not lying. Okay. Oh, and I love your podcast, by the way. I like listening to that. A couple by the way, congratulations to the comment winner. Shout out to the comment winner. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. Comment below if you use any third-party apps. For example, Cleaner. If you use like an analytics. I got shadow banned just for having too much cleaner and too much blocking at the same time. So I want you to comment below if you use anything else. By the way, guys, since I have your attention, I am transferring a lot of my content slash more of Jade. See, like, if you want more of Jade, I have something coming up just for you called personal. If you want more of Jade, I'm just letting you know there's going to be stage two of Ask Jade Show, which is going to be an application form coming soon. So I will be transferring some of you guys that I love of the Dharma Nation onto my application. Whoa! That rhymed. Like and... Subscribe. Alright, that was all for today's episode. Now, if you want to be on the next Ask Jade, there is a link down below. It is free. It is just for you guys. I will be moving all these calls somewhere else, but usually it's just a phone call. And let me know where you want me to contact you. There's a link below. I do ask a few questions to make sure I'm filtering through the best of you guys. Since you are the best squad on earth. I want to make sure it's the freaking Dharma Nation and not some freaking low gang. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Make sure you click the links below. Check out the podcasts. I'll catch you in the next one. What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching. Hold up, if you could do me a huge favor, give this video a like and hit that subscribe button to turn on my post notifications. That would mean the world to me and I really